The Mackay Stingers and the Townsville Dragon Boat Clubs arrived in force and proved they weren't just there to make up the numbers. <laughs> Mackay brought 20 experienced paddlers to the state titles and despite being a little light on with men, they made a big impression. It's been, for us, excellent. We don't get to compete in regattas very often because it takes, we have to fly to regattas. So we've done really, really well for a small team who doesn't really go to many regattas. Mackay made two grand finals and pushed the mighty Brisbane and Sunshine Coast teams all the way. The coach says the team is now on a recruitment drive to attract more men to the club. It's, it's one of those things that anyone can do and everyone can have a go at, so why not? Townsville didn't have the success of the Mackay team bringing 14 women paddlers to the event but they're building for a regatta of their own in June. We're going to do um, a regatta in June and hopefully we'll be able to open it up a bit more to get some more, um, more like men especially and women too and hopefully start a juniors team up too. The coach says the team used the event to test themselves in a high class competition against the best teams in the state. We're really excited about coming down here and we just want to learn as much as possible we can with the most experienced teams that are here. Including teams that placed well at the recent World Club titles, the Tawaka Dragons from Brisbane, Brisbane River Dragons and champion Manly teams. Steve Marshall, Win News.